Anu, originally known as an in Sumerian mythology and later as Anu in Akkadian, represents a divine personification of the sky, revered as the king of gods and an ancestor to many deities in ancient Mesopotamian religion. Anu was perceived as the source of both divine and human kingship, symbolizing heavenly authority and legitimacy. Although his role was predominantly passive, Anu's significance was undeniable, opening the enumerations of deities in numerous Mesopotamian texts. The identity of Anu's spouse is subject to multiple traditions, with Kai, Urash and Antu being equated with each other over time, all symbolizing the earth akin to Anu's representation of the heavens. In alternative accounts, his consort is the goddess Namu. Additionally, ancestral figures such as Anshar or Alala are frequently listed alongside his spouses and children, forming the basis of genealogical narratives such as the Enuma Elis. Anu's appearances in mythological tales are sparse but impactful. In the Akkadian epic of Gilgamesh, he's depicted as a fatherly figure to Ishtar, Inanna, who persuades him to grant her the Bull of Heaven. Another myth portrays Anu summoning the mortal hero Adapa, offering him the chance for immortality, which Adapa ultimately rejects. In Hurrian myths, Anu is depicted as a former ruler of the gods, overthrown by Kamabi, resulting in the birth of Teshub, the weather god. Anu's character is intricately tied to Mesopotamian astronomy, with the sky being divided into three zones, with Anu presiding over the stars between Enlil and Ea's respective domains. While his role was originally more circumscribed, later theological developments under Seleucid rule expanded Anu's influence to encompass the entire firmament. Despite his prominence, Anu's iconography is notably absent from Mesopotamian artwork, with no recognizable anthropomorphic representations. Instead, symbols such as a horned crown on a pedestal are associated with him, depicted on Kuduru, boundary stones, and Neo-Assyrian reliefs. In essence, Anu embodies the celestial realm and serves as a potent symbol of divine authority and cosmic order in Mesopotamian mythology, despite the ambiguity surrounding his character and worship practices.